took my first like PSAT and I got like a 1220 on it. And my math score was like five in the 500s. And my first, I took that when I was a freshman and my first actual SAT was when I was a junior and I got a 1310 and my math score was a 670. Transitioning from my junior to senior year, I studied a lot and I got 770 on the math section and I got a 1460 total score on that. And then I decided to take the SAT for a third time just to see what I could, if I could improve at all. And I took um, an October SAT and I was able to get a perfect math score on it uh, in my senior year. And I got, and I hit 1500, which was my ultimate like dream goal. So I'm really happy about that. I mean, the walkthroughs are by far like the most helpful videos I've seen for SAT math because it's like before when I would try to self-study, I mean, taking practice tests are really important, but when I would try to like self-study, I would sometimes need a bit of confidence to solve some problems and to kind of like think through it. So after like listening to you and like watching you break down like the more challenging problems and the reasoning behind them, uh, I, I was able to learn that and then I then was able to like become confident enough to like apply that to my own problems. Having someone there to walk through the, uh, the problems with me, like, and it was, you know, kind of working through those math sections was by far like the most important thing to help me improve my math score and to help me like minimize those mistakes. So yeah, it helped me a lot. Um, I think the, my 1500 score is a score that I can submit to like mo pretty much any college that I want to apply to. Um, it's at least at the 50%, 50% or above. So like I'm applying to some pretty ambitious schools and I can now submit instead of like risking it going test optional and then not being as competitive. So that's really important. And also um, for scholarships uh, like 1500 is a good threshold for a lot of like really important scholarships for uh, for different colleges. So I think like getting this score was super important because it kind of relieves a lot of my stress that I had about like my, and my insecurities about my test score. So yeah. I would definitely recommend the Scalar Learning Channel. I would recommend it because it gives you not only confidence, but it gives you kind of like a good baseline knowledge of the math section it, and and the SAT in general it'll just break down all like the test and it, so if you keep watching keep going through the sections you can really learn how to like master it and how to really get the specifics down and how to avoid the certain types of questions so that you will gain that confidence to succeed yourself